Hi, I'm Mike. This is my YouTube channel. So, for a while now I've been thinking about starting up a YouTube channel and I've not really known how to go about it. I have deliberated, I've researched, I've watched hundreds of hours of YouTube videos on how to start a YouTube channel. And it's great because it's guys that have been there, they've started, but all doing these videos after years of being there. They've got hundreds of thousands of subscribers. It's not day one. It's not like I am now. This is my fifth attempt at recording this intro. It's not as easy as people make it out to be. I'm starting, as you can see, in a room at the back of my house. I want to turn this into some form of YouTube set. I want to go through the kit that I've chose and why I've got it. I want to go through where I went and how I found out about what exactly it was that I needed to get started. Now, I've got a background in social media. I've got a background in web development. So that that's great. Like, skill set wise, I'm sorted. Confidence, maybe not. So we'll see how it goes. I'm going to start off today by moving some of this about and just seeing if I can make it into a presentable set. Seeing then if we can do some kit reviews and go through why I've chose the kit I have and see if it was the right option. One of the things I've realised is that it sounds like it's echoing a bit in here, but I don't know, so I'm going to have to wait and see once I get this in the Premiere Pro. If it is, I'm going to have to find a way of deadening the sound without making the place look like a dungeon. Let's see what happens, eh? As you can see, it looks a bit dark in that back corner. I'm gonna have to do something to lighten it up. Just some of the random things that you find when you're in the bikes. A pair of Shimano brake pads. <sighs> so, starting to look a little bit like, but turned off the LED lights that I had and put on the normal lights from in the room. I'm not quite sure how they are. I'm also not quite sure on that camera angle because I think that that microphone is going to be way too far away. So I'm going to stop the video. I'm going to check. See what I need to do. So I've swapped out to my f1.8 lens, 50mm. I've swapped back to the kit lens. 18 to 55 mil, and it's just doing the job right. When I was using this, the Canon 50 mil, it, its autofocus was noisy. I could hear it, and I'm that far away from the camera. I can't even put my hand out and touch the camera from where I'm sitting. Yet, I'm sure that in the future, I will swap to this lens to start doing videos once I get a better set. Once I've got some depth behind me and the chair isn't straight up against the wall. I'm sure that at that point, things will change and this lens will become ideal because I can manually lock off the focus. I can make some really cool effects with it. And for photography, it's phenomenal. But I just don't think that for this vlogging setup, it's the right lens. Not at the moment anyway. But now, I've got my shelves back can put cool stuff on them. There is no YouTube player pillar going to be going up there. I'm not down for scatter cushions. But some other cool stuff might live on there. Bike stuff. Camera kit. We'll see. We'll see how it grows. See what's next. The next thing is though to get some better lighting side in here. 
This is running off three different types of bulb in this room. Now I've got some really, really high powered LEDs. I'm just worried that they're going to wash this place out a bit because of the fact of the white ceiling. I'm going to try them on. We'll see what happens. Let's see how that changes it. So, I'm here, I'm at work, I'm just getting my first proper video sorted on the computer. And I've realised, my final clip that I recorded the other night, I didn't even say goodbye. It's as though, in the rush, to make sure that I got all the footage that I needed, to make sure that the room was sorted, I forgot the most important thing. Lesson learned, having to record it afterwards, at work. As you can all see, I work in a bike shop. Fits in perfectly, doesn't it, with my uh, love for bikes. So yeah, um, first video, not too bad a job I think. A um, little bit of information on the lights in the, uh, in the room at home. Uh, swap back to the LEDs and turn the normal room lights off. It's made quite a big difference, so yeah, hopefully the next videos will be quite a bit more professional. Uh, definitely a lot more refined. And I won't forget to say thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe and follow the journey, then feel free to do so. Um, as some of the other guys says about smashing and, and all this lot, I don't have a clue. It's up to you. Uh, I can't promise it'll always be great content, but can promise it'll always be me so if you uh, if you like that subscribe like it hit the bell do all the amazing great things that you meant to ask for thanks for watching bye